It's your boy FGI Cody, man. Y'all tune in to Bogey TV. Man, we here with FGI Cody, man. What's up, boy? Shit, man, I've been working. Man. man. Putting in work. For the average person who don't know, man, what is your music about and what's your message? Like, what type of music do you bring to the street, man? I mean, really, you know, I'm versatile with it, so, like, I'm gonna I'm I'm give you anything you need, you know what I'm saying? So, if you, if you like some hard street shit, I got that, you know what I mean? If you, if you ain't ever feeling it, you can do that, too, you know what I mean? Like, it's whatever. But really, man, if you had to come down to a message, like, you know, FGI, forever going in, you know what I'm saying? Like, apply that pressure, like, it's not even just with your music, it's not even no game shit, none of that. It's like, apply that to your life, apply that to, to these niggas, man, to these, to these females, man, like, put pressure on them, forever going in, we always going in on something. If it ain't music, we get in that bag, you know what I'm saying, so, forever going in. All right, if you didn't become a musician, what would you be doing right now, this second? I don't know, like, if I didn't, like, have music in my life at all, like, I don't know, man, like, probably be editing music still, man. Like, like music is like a, a huge part of my life. Even if I ain't making music, I'm listening to music, you know what I mean? If I ain't doing that, I'm editing. Like, it's always something to do with music. Like, constantly, like, I can be doing either. I can be playing the game. I'm, I'm freestyling, I'm rapping in my head, I'm thinking about the next song, the next move. So it's, I don't know, I don't know what I'll do without music. So it's like, I'll probably be an artist though, you know what I'm saying? I'm kind of bad with that pen. <laughs> get, get the drawing stuff. You can have your fans remember one thing about you. What would it be? The fact that I always keep it on. Like that's, that's you know what I mean. You may be on my own music, I'm still gonna be hunting. Whatever. Okay. For well, people who don't know, what's like the average day in Kalamazoo? Like, what is Kalamazoo like, man? Like, for people who don't know. <laughs> Kalamazoo crazy, man. There's a bunch of childhood people out here, man. Like. You know, I've been here my whole life, so it's like, it's my city, it is what it is. But it's just like, I don't know, I see a lot of irresponsibility, man. People backwards, man. I'm like, I got a song called 962, man. You know what I'm saying? Check that out, it's on YouTube. So it's like, you don't understand what I'm talking about. If you, if you know, if you know Kevin Mizzou, listen to that song. You, you'll, you'll get the gist. <laughs> what, what made you want to rap? Like, what made you be like, man, this is what I want to do, or... You know. Well, it's like two stages to that. Cause at first, I, I really was like playing around with the beats, you know what I'm saying? Doing a little editing and mixing and stuff for my boy. Shout out Pedro Danero, by the way. But uh, I don't know, I brought a, pulled up a beat and that man just freestyled on me, went crazy. And I was sitting in the studio and I was like, damn, I wanna do that. You know what I'm saying? A couple years later, look at me now, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, going crazy on these tracks. Let's talk about this mixtape, man. Like, what was your process on making this mixtape, man? Like, and what all features you got on it, man? Like, how much work did you put into this mixtape? Man, real talk, I kind of kind of secluded myself from the world for a little bit, man. Like, I got a couple features, you know, with the game, you know. I got your boy, I got your boy, uh, Chris Bogan on there. <laughs> uh, we got b Mono. Uh, who else we got You know, my boy Savo on there. So it's like... I got, a, I got a couple of features on there, but I, I pretty much, after I got all the features done, like, I sat in the stool, you know what I mean, like, for hours, just putting in work, getting songs done, editing, you know what I'm saying, mixing stuff down, to do all my own stuff, so it's like, you know what I mean, like, just put in work, you know what I'm saying, grind mode. All right, for the people who haven't heard the mixtape yet, man, like, what can they expect out of this mixtape, man? Like, what you bring it to them, man? Uh, first thing, versatility, man, you know what I'm saying? Second thing, real shit, man, you know what I'm saying? Like. Be speaking facts on this shit, so it's like you got you got can't do nothing but relate to it or respect it. You know what I'm saying? Even if you can't relate to it, you still gotta respect it. Like it's something to prove. You know what I mean? Like this, this first tape. You know what I mean? Like I had, I had to let people know this is what I do. You know what I'm saying? I'm a contender in this game. You know what I mean? Like, it ain't, and then to be played with. So I try to give something for everybody to like. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't care if you're a female. I don't care if you're white, black, Chinese, whatever you wanna hear. You know what I'm saying? I, I might got something for you, you know what I'm saying? Check out the tape, something to prove, it's on YouTube, look me up. <laughs> How do you feel about the Kalamazoo rap scene right now? Like, is there anybody you'll work with or? I mean, look, look, I'm not gonna hate on nobody, man. If you got talent, you got talent. It's just like, 
a lot of times what I see is, you know, we, we close to the D. We in the middle, you know what I'm saying? Like, everybody want to, I feel like everybody want to. Wanna be like like everybody from the deep, you know what I'm saying? Like be yourself. I'm not afraid to be myself because what you see is what you get where my heart, my sleep. So it's like just I, I see a lot of monkey see, monkey do, man. I ain't feeling that. So it's like, man, people be supporting people who really ain't got no type of talent. Like I ain't hating on nobody, man. It's like if you don't like my music, please tell me. Cause I, you know what I'm saying? I, I'll make it better. Whatever we can do. But I just I, I ain't really feeling it around here like that. You know, like, it's a couple people I work with. Um like I just I just reached out to uh, Yancey, like, yo, what's up, let's work. He said, get something in motion. Cool, so we're gonna do something like that. Um It's a couple other people I done tried to fail with, man, so it's just just hit or miss out here, but I ain't really a huge fan of the Cannabis your music scene, man. So as time progressed, man, I see you've been getting better and better with this music, man. Like like what be your methods when you were sitting there writing, man? Like, what's your thinking process on dropping the hit when you record it, man? man? Really, I be feeling like, I be my own biggest enemy, man. I be trying to figure out how I can make the next song better. How I can go harder on the next track. So it's like, if I, if I hear a mistake or something, you know what I mean? I fix it. So I can't do nothing to get, get better, you know what I mean? Like, again, that's that forever going in mentality. You know what I mean? Gotta keep going, you gotta keep pushing, you gotta evolve, you gotta change. You can't stay the same because, you know, especially in this music industry nowadays, man, they like you one week, next week you over with. You know what I mean? Like, so you gotta, I gotta be versatile. Like, what makes you stay on your A game, bro? Man, but no, no cap, I really don't even like, I don't even care about nothing. I think that's what that's what made, made me unique when it comes to like relevance at all because, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's not my biggest thing. These, these niggas be out here trying to, uh, that ain't. That ain't what I do. I be out here, you know what I'm saying, being me. So anybody who listens to my music, they like it. They just, you know, maybe be out here, hey, I ain't tripping. It is what it is. If you had one message you could get to an upcoming artist, man, like, what would it be? Like, from learning from your mistakes coming up, what would it be? Don't stay the same, man. Always evolve, always change. Look for another way to do something. Always try to, you know, improve on yourself. Don't ever get stagnant. Don't ever stay in one place. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, fuck what these niggas talking about. You know what I'm saying? Because I had a lot of niggas telling me this shit. You know what I mean? Oh, I can't do this. I can't do that. Oh, you need to try this. You need to try that. You know what I'm saying? It's like, like now nah, I wrap circles around niggas. This shit is easy. <laughs> Who influenced you in this music game? Man, I got a wide, you know what I'm saying? Like, met when it comes to that. Like, I listen to everybody. You know what I'm saying? Like, if I had to say, like, a favorite rapper, though, you know, I mess with Gates. So it's like, Cause he be real, man. Like no matter what he talking about, he be speaking his truth. You know what I mean? So I can't, I can't do nothing but respect that. But like, man, like I grew up listening to like old R and B stuff. You know, so it's it, all kinds of stuff, man. I, I, I play some country sometimes. But I feel like, like it is what it is. Like I feel like you can't be a musician or an artist and be closed minded to other types of music. You know what I'm saying? That's why I draw my energy from different places. That's why I can be so versatile. What do you feel is your best song? And why did you choose that song? I got a song that's unreleased, but uh, it's called Soul. Like, ain't nobody heard it yet. But it'll probably be out soon. I'm, I'm gonna finish it up. So, but uh, personally, I, I picked that song because I put my heart on that track. You know what I'm saying? Like, I put my soul on that track. Like, my first line on that song was, I put my motherfucking soul on this track. Like, it was the realest thing I ever dropped, you know what I'm saying? Like, not saying anything else wasn't real, it was just like, I touched some stuff that I don't even talk about to other people, you know what I'm saying? Like, my, my girl don't even know about stuff like that. So it's just like, I put my feelings, like, my heart, my soul, like, down there crying on the track, you feel me? So it was just, it was some real ass shit. How is it working with artists that's under FGI, man? Like, what is the chemistry like when y'all get in the studio together, man? Like, man, it's, it's, it's like, it's all up, man. Like, you know what I mean? Like, like, I don't, like, I'll say the song, you know what I'm saying? Like, these niggas my brothers, man, my friends, you know what I'm saying? So, it's like, it's always on some, like, like, we always bouncing ideas off each other. It's always a chemistry. It's always a synergy there. So, it's like, it just, it work out. Like, everybody cool, you know what I'm saying? Like, if we don't like something, we fix it, you know what I'm saying? Like, ain't no, ain't no hating on the next nigga. Ain't nobody mad at each other or nothing. It just, it just work, you know what I'm saying? We push it together good. Like, it's crazy. What's next for FGI Cody, man? Probably gonna drop another tape soon, man. Like, but it's not gonna be like the first one. Like again, every song I do is different than the last. It's never gonna sound like the same. So, 
Excuse me. So it's like this song. I mean, this this mixtape. I'm gonna call it something to prove, something to say. So my first tape was something to prove. I had to prove to y'all that I could do this. You know what I'm saying now I got something to say. You know what I mean? Like I want to touch your brains with this. What's the hardest part about recording or? promoting or getting yourself out there, man. What you feel like is the hardest part for you? All right, let me break that down a couple of things. You said promoting, you know what I mean? You said recording. All right, like recording is, it's easy to put a lot of pressure on yourself, especially like someone like me, man. Like I think about stuff a lot, you know what I mean? So I'm constantly putting pressure on myself. So I can become better. I, like I have a fear of peaking. I don't ever want to peak. I don't ever want to get to a point where I'm like, damn, I don't think I can do any better than that. I'm, I feel like I never get to that point. I never allow myself to get to that point. So with that, that's like one of my biggest things is putting a lot of pressure on myself, put weight on my shoulders when I really don't need to. Then like with promote, it's like, it's hard because it's not really so much hard. It's just like, especially in my city, like niggas don't really pay attention. You know what I mean? Like they like what they like. That is what it is, you know what I'm saying? But like, I got niggas out of town, you know what I'm saying? They love my shit, you know what I'm saying? They, they, they mess with my music, it's crazy. Like, how much love I get on T, but up here it's like, niggas don't even be knowing I rap. And sometimes that's my fault, cause I don't fuck with a lot of niggas. But, like, people, it's kind of, you know what I'm saying? They like, oh, my man's rap, I fuck with him, you know what I'm saying? Like, it ain't, like, if you don't know me, they don't fuck with me, that's, that's the type shit. So it's, it is what it is, I ain't mad at that next nigga, but I ain't tripping. Thoughts about, like, People who can't rap, or well, I'm gonna call it uh, copying, swagger jacking. Like, how do you feel about that? Do you feel like people who write their own raps should be farther than people who don't? It depends really on the situation, man. Cause like, you ain't finna get nothing for free, you know what I'm saying? You ain't finna, without work, you know what I'm saying? Without practice, you're not finna go nowhere with your music. But it's like, for real, it was one day I didn't know how to rap, you know what I'm saying? Like, a couple months later, I was I was doing it, you know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like if I can do it, anybody can do it, right? You know what I mean? Like, especially nowadays, these niggas out here making millions off of these stupid ass songs. Like, I'd be like, wow, I like this. Like, all right, you know what I mean? It'll do what it is. Like I said, I ain't hating on nobody. Get your money, bro. But, you know, so it's just like, if, you know I'm saying, you put that time and that energy into it, man, it's gonna show on your music, man. So it's like, just, Put in that effort, you know what I'm saying? Go in, forever going in. <laughs> Let them know where they can find that mixtape, man. Let them know man, where they gotta look, go, bro. Look me up on any major platform. We got iTunes, iHeartRadio, Pandora, Spotify, Instagram music, Facebook music. I got a Facebook music, Facebook page, look it up, that G.I. Cody. Um, anywhere you can listen to music at, basically, Deezer. I, I can name these all day, just YouTube, you know what I'm saying? The, the quickest one for me, you know, everybody mess with YouTube. So, anyway, you can look it up. Maybe you got an iPhone, get on Apple Music, boom, you know what I'm saying? You can get a crack, I'm on there. Man, I swear to God, my trust level so fucked up. I be on edge, fuck niggas, make me wanna bust something. My anxiety be so high, I wanna up chuck. Tell the voices in my head, shut the fuck up. Tryna release some of my tension, nigga, run up. Can't even pay attention cause I'm fucked up Man, the way a nigga feeling, you better watch out I wanna grab the pole, hit the lights and black out I can't let it break me though, I can't cop out If a nigga got a problem, tell him pop out I'm from a place where most of my niggas is dropouts Instead of staying in school, they in the trap houses Ain't no scholarships, they making deals in back alleys and slapping hands